Are you tired of getting bullied for being bad at Super Mario Odyssey? Well, this is the video for you. I'm going to teach you how to get good at Mario Odyssey starting from square one. First, you need to purchase the game. I recommend that you buy this specific one from Walmart because of its cheap price. Also, you need a Nintendo Switch if you don't already have one. I highly encourage you to purchase this one because it's 100% reliable. Next, you turn on your Switch and open up the game. Oh, I forgot to mention something very important. You need a controller. There are many different types of controllers, but I highly recommend that you use one of these. You either want the drum set controller, the dance pad controller, or my personal favorite, the DK Bongos. So the first thing you want to do after you open up the game is to enter assist mode. This is extremely important as having assist mode on makes you look like a much better player. And then, after you start the game, you just want to beat it. It doesn't matter how you do it, you just want to kill Bowser and beat the game. After you finish the game, the first thing you should do is get 1000 coins. My favorite way to farm coins is going into the sub area, getting the moon and leaving, and then repeating. This works really well because you get 5 coins every time you collect the moon. Now the reason you needed those coins is very important, because now, you can buy the boxer shorts, which instantly makes you 10 times better at the game. Now I'll teach you the most important movement in the game, which obviously is the bonk. You bonk by either rolling into a wall or long jumping into a wall. And as you can see, it is a very useful movement option. The next lesson is mashing. You want to go up to the Odyssey and then jump into this pole and throw Cappy. You should then be able to clip inside the Odyssey, and you can proceed to mash to your heart's content. The final thing that you need to learn is how to kill a Goomba. A lot of people struggle with this, but hopefully this in-depth guide will help you. So you see a Goomba off in the distance, what do you do? Well obviously, you point the camera upwards so you can't see anything, and then you walk towards it. Then you let the Goomba hit you until you are at 1 HP. Then you shake your remote so you can capture it. Then bring the Goomba to a pool of water and simply jump into the water, and the Goomba will die. Now this might sound like a little overcomplicated, but trust me, this is the only way to kill a Goomba. If you try to jump on it, it's not going to work. You're just going to end up dying like I did here. Yeah, obviously this video is a joke, so I hope no one came here actually looking for how to get good, because they probably didn't learn that from this video. But thanks for watching, and please be sure to subscribe.